Students in fourth grade need to understand that the Earth is a complex and dynamic set of interconnected systems. One concept of this is the understanding that water occurs underground, above ground, and in the atmosphere. Bodies of water are found on land and can be characterized as either lentic or lotic. Lentic is water that is still and unmoving, whereas lotic is water that is flowing. An easy way to remember lotic is that low sounds like flow. Let's take a look at the following bodies of water. We have a lake, a river, a pond, and a stream. The lake and the pond would most likely be lentic because they are clearly unmoving, whereas the river and the stream would be lotic because they are flowing. Some of the questions that may arise throughout this unit are the following. What would happen if someone cannonballed into a lake? Would it then be considered lotic? Does the speed of the river affect the rate at which sediment is deposited at the delta? And finally, why does erosion occur more rapidly around lotic water? Now this question is extremely relevant to the content of our unit. However, it does not lend itself to an investigation. A better way of wording this could be, how does the speed of the water affect the rate of the erosion? This question can be tested right in our classroom. Take a moment to discuss with your team how we could best investigate this question.